Hey everyone, welcome back to another iLogic video. Uh, today I want to give you guys a demonstration on a project that I've been working on with one of my subscribers. And my portion of the project was to make this structure right here, which is this uh, piece right here, and basically make it make the model easy for it to be manufactured. So you can see it got divided into pieces. Obviously, this you know you can't manufacture this. Uh, you know I don't think there's a machine to manufacture this in one go. And the 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 start. Uh, the height of this is like six meters, or actually no, it's like ten meters tall. It, it can be up to ten meters, so it's uh, easier to manufacture if it was cut up to these pieces, obviously, right? And so that was my portion of the project. Let me just give you guys a demonstration on what it it is. Uh, so if I increase the height of the cone right here, it's in Spanish. I'm sorry, guys. If I type uh, thirty-five hundred, it's going to uh, it's going to add another piece down here because the, this is the sheet size. This is the user input of uh, the sheet size that they're going to be using. Obviously, uh, 3,500 for that height, this is going to have to be cut into two pieces. So let's take a look at, at what it does. Uh, so it's trying to maximize the whole sheet size of the 3,000 and then any leftover, it gets pushed onto the, the bottom ones. Uh, down or below here so That's what it's doing and then uh, up here. It's trying to maximize the whole 3,000 and then I think this one right here is going to be less than 3,000 So let's take a look on the flat pattern on this one right here If we measure the the width that's 2,000, okay, and So that means the other ones should be 3,000 So if I measure this one Yeah, so it's 3,000. Two, uh, two millimeters, that's the thickness of it. Uh, I still haven't perfected it right now. And so yeah, let's go ahead and, and mess with the diameter. Let's uh, let's mess with the bigger diameter. So let's make it uh, three meters wide. Uh, oh, I forgot to, damn it, damn it, I forgot to press save. If I press yes, well, it's not gonna do anything. Yeah, that's, uh, I still gotta work on this portion of the code. All right, come on, come on. How many more? All right. Oh no, one more. Is that it? All right, that's it. Uh, so it's running through the code right now. It has a progress window down here. Uh, so you kind of keep track on on how it's progressing. And uh, I made this on Visual Basic. It's a exe file that is it, it's running right now. All right, let's hit the re rebuild. Uh, so let's measure the the ID now. Oops. So yep. So that's what we inputted. Uh, we inputted three thousand for the diameters. That's the radius. That's correct. Um, so let's take a look at the uh, sheet metal uh, flat patterns. So right here we're maximizing as much as we can with the least amount of scrap on this uh, sheet uh, size. And twelve hundred is a maximum. Right here, uh, two millimeters is uh, the thickness of it. I still gotta work on that. Uh, right there at 1200 and we have that little small portion right here that's just going to have to be scrapped and if we increase the sheet size up here uh, to 1500 uh, then we might oh I forgot to press save again <laughs> dang two for one uh, two for zero clumsy me all right come on so uh, 1500 uh, it should get rid of this layer right here Come on, come on. All right, there we go. There we go. It's running through the the exe file right now. And by the way, if you haven't subscribed and you're into iLogic videos, make sure to subscribe. I make iLogic videos weekly. I try to give you guys tips and tricks. And um, yeah, I try to answer any questions that you guys have down below. And I don't get too many questions. So if, uh, if you have a question, you might be the first one I answer. All right, so let's measure this. This should be a uh, 1500. Yep, it's 1500. And then down here below is 1500. Oh, oh yeah, that's 1000 just because of uh, the remaining. Uh, yeah, I was wondering why that was 1500. Now this piece right here, why is that piece so short? And huh. Oh, I guess that's, okay, I guess that makes sense. Yeah, all right. I thought it was a glitch, Never mind. Um, 
so yeah so that's basically the the code i i made uh, so let's take a look at this 1500 this got wider we're trying to maximize that whole sheet size um yeah so hopefully you guys get some inspiration from this video and if once again uh, like this video it helps me out and that's the least i ask of you guys uh, actually that's the most i ask you guys just hit that like that's the only thing i'm asking from you guys just hit that like button until it turns blue anyways talk to you guys later